from the NBC studios in Burbank, California, The Tonight Show with Jay Leno, featuring Bradford Marsalis and The Tonight Show Band. Tonight, Jay welcomes Sigourney Weaver, Don Francisco, and the music of Curtis Steiger. I'm Ed Hall, and now, Jay Leno! because of the game, but thanks for staying up. Well, let's see what's in the news. Of course, the most bizarre story of the week, I talked about this last night, it turns out it's true, you know about this? Doctors in the Philippines have confirmed that a 32-year-old male nurse is pregnant. Not making this up. No, no, this is true. Through some freak of nature, the guy's got both male and female organs. This is true, and he's pregnant. And believe me, nobody is more pleased about it than Dan Quayle. He's finally... He's <laughs> He's finally found a pregnant mother who's also a working father. He works out great. Now, <laughs> uh, let's see what's going on in international news. Uh, the Bush administration is said to have a blueprint for destroying the economy of Iraq. And you know something? I think it's going to work. You know, they've been testing it over here for the last four years. And boy, working great. Yeah. As I'm sure you know, President Bush has ordered the Haitian refugees back home again. You know, living in a country, no jobs, a government in chaos, riots in the streets. But you know, the Haitians still want to come here. <laughs> God bless them. No, why is he being so tough on the Haitians? You see what he did today in New York City? Today, he had the slogan on the Statue of Liberty change from give me your tired, poor, huddled masses to management refuses the right to serve service anyone. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Actually, the ironic thing is Bush keeps talking about family value. I'll tell you something, after 12 years of Reaganomics, the value of most families has dropped about 50%, hasn't it? <laughs> but he, he's not the only one. Bill Clinton, he's having uh, trouble with family values too. Yeah. At a rally last week, he said he didn't want to be judged on one mistake. Okay, which one? <laughs> And at a rally yesterday, presidential candidate Jerry Brown says he wants an America that works. Hey, how about a Jerry Brown that works, huh? <laughs> when was the last time this guy had a job? The mid-70s? <laughs> how about Roth Perot? You been following this guy? Yeah. You know what you know? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait till tomorrow. <laughs> Well, you know, in order to run for president, Ross Perot had to reveal how much money he has. Turns out the guy's worth something like $3.3 billion. If he's got that much dough, can't he spring for 10 bucks and get a decent haircut? Come on! Huh? What's he using, a flow bee on his head? Look at that thing. Surprised he's not bleeding. And according to Ross Perot's financial statement, this is unbelievable to me. He has over a million dollars in his checking account. No, a million dollars in his checking account. Can you imagine the toaster he must have gotten, huh? Oh, I bet it was one of those four slice deals with the chrome sides, you know, and the black trim. Oh, boy, that's, that's my dream toaster, yeah. And Washington State Democratic leaders have voted not to demand the resignation of Brock Adams. Remember Brock Adams? He was a senator who was accused of sexually harassing eight different women. In fact, one official said of Adams, I can't think of a single senator with higher moral standards. And you know something? Neither can I. <laughs> and here, here is another amazing story. Science is unbelievable. Scientists say now through genetic engineering, they can make an absolutely crush-proof tomato. You see that in the news tonight? The tomato is crush-proof, you know, when packing it and stuff. See, what they do is they inject the tomato with genes from an airline dinner roll. See this one? <laughs> Boy, don't throw it at anybody. Ow! <laughs> you know, the possibilities with this genetic engineering stuff, it's unbelievable what they can do. Like I read in the paper, they're working on some new kind of mozzarella cheese 
which contains genes from a carrier pigeon. No, this is true. <laughs> See, this way you get a pizza that can deliver itself. <laughs> now, now, here's my question. Now, here's my question. If scientists can make food that looks and tastes better, how come they can't make the food at Denny's look like the pictures of the food on the menu? <laughs> And in Detroit, the first Chrysler Viper came off the assembly line last week. You know the Viper, big Viper fan? Well, the Viper is a very significant car. It's the first automobile in history to be named after the salesman that sold it to you. Yeah. <laughs> tech company in Northern California, it's another unbelievable thing, has invented a fax machine that fits inside your pants pocket. Imagine that, a fax machine that fits in your pocket. In fact, they can't decide which feels better, sending or receiving. They're still working, <laughs> working on that. And last but not least, anybody see Aliens 3 yet? Have you seen the movie? Well, Sigourney's with us tonight. We'll talk about that. Pretty amazing. You know, the monster is what kills me. I'm watching this movie. Now, if you haven't seen it, the title character is like this huge grasshopper-looking creature that eats people and then spits them out again. That's what it is. The monster just eats people and regurgitates them. Then at the end of the film, there's a disclaimer. Any similarity to any person living or dead is purely coincidental. Are they really afraid of a lawsuit here, huh? I mean, are there large groups of cannibalistic, bulimic grasshoppers out there going, hey, hey, that's our lifestyle you're making. Anyway, Sigourney Weaver is here. Hey, welcome back here. Welcome back. I didn't go anywhere. I just walked over here. <laughs> you know, this show business stuff today. I was telling the studio about this. You know, today my mom goes out to get the paper. There's a magician in the driveway. There's a magician juggling for my mom. My mom says, oh, I, I bet my son would love to put you on the show. Ma, don't tell anybody that, all right? Please, no more magicians in the driveway. What do we have here? Oh, now this is interesting here, you know. You ever pick up those uh, magazines around the country like the Penny Saver, or the Reader, the One Advertiser, People Advertise? You think buy stuff like Garage Well, you know, I went through some of these and you realize there are a lot of celebrities that advertise in these magazines. These are some of the ads, we cut them out. Here you go. This one's kind of interesting. Uh, wanted old hubcaps, no chain saddles, leather goods. Let me try them on. If they fit, I'll buy them. Madonna. <laughs> Here's an interesting one. Help Wanted, great opportunity, large charity organization, seeking new leader, salary, sky's the limit, expense account, jet planes, limo, apply at United Way. <laughs> Here's an interesting one. I wonder if anybody answered this. For sale, Thighmaster, Stairmaster, Nautitrack, Treadmill, Solaflex, Slimfast, never used, owned by Starve, Jake and the Fat Man. <laughs> Don't ask for Jake. <laughs> Here's one that was in one of the Maryland papers. Help wanted, economic advisor, no skill or experience necessary. Call White House, ask for George. <laughs> Giant liquidation, going out, of, uh, going out of plumbing business. Must sell entire stock of lead pipes, brass knuckles, cement shoes, and horse's head. Write Jay Gotti, Sing Sing Prison, New York. <laughs> There you go for sale. Mercedes hasn't been driven since the beginning of primaries. Call Pat Buchanan. <laughs> Hotel manager wanted. Must be cheap, ruthless, and mean spirited. Arrogance and contempt for little people. A plus. Contact Hemsley Palace, New York. <laughs> Concert tickets for sale. Poison, Mega Death, Grateful Dead. Contact Dr. Kevorkian before it's too late. <laughs> Y'all know Millie, the White House dog, made $900,000 on her book last year. I guess her attorney forced her to take out this ad. Legal notice, I am no longer responsible for the debts of my owner. <laughs> Millie, the White House dog. <laughs> Here's one, it was so small I almost overlooked it. Help wanted tattoo artist to fix spelling error on left buttock. Call Cher. <laughs> Legal services, can't beat the rap, afraid of going to prison, you don't need a lawyer, you need a good jury, call Simi Valley Trial. <laughs> Here 
There you go. Looking for love. Single white presidential candidate. Seeks first lady. Must share interest. New age thought. Linda Ronstadt records. Fighting Klingons. No weirdos! <laughs> We end on this one, but uh, this one's a funny woman's panties never used. Call Sharon Stone. <laughs> and last but not least, do, you, do reading these ads give you eye strain? Call us, we'll sue, get millions. Jacobian liars, attorneys at law, Beverly Hill. And we'll be right back with Sigourney Weaver right after. the ocean, a day at the beach, a ray of pure sunshine, but I had to dump her. She didn't have HBO, because this summer HBO has a lineup so hot, so outrageous, so over the edge, it transcends mere human companionship. Sounds crazy? Get HBO this summer and see for yourself. Too late to check this out. The scoop. A sporty coupe that's fun to drive. And since you get free service and maintenance, it's also fun to own. So any sleepless nights won't be from worry. The scoop from Hyundai. Yes, Hyundai. For a $750 rebate on scoop, see your Hyundai dealer now. Before it's too late. EO of a major corporation. It's a small business. Okay, it's a pet shop. But if we're gonna grow, I've gotta manage my time better. So I got a little help from US West. A risk pager, even second line. Can you hold this my other line? Ellen Pep? Yes, I just got your fax. Right, we match people to pet. With all these time savers from US West, I have more time for entertaining clients. You've got something in your teeth. US West, making the most of your time. It's inventory liquidation time at Overturf. And we're overstocked with nice, clean, low mileage trade-ins and lease returns. Many of these vehicles will be sold way back of NADA book value, like these 91 Dodge Dynasties, five of them in stock starting at just $89.90. And there's 89 Audi 100s, three of them in stock starting at just $11,950. And look at this 90 Subaru Loyal with automatic and error, just $49.99 or $105 a month. And we have a great selection of used conversion vans, so hurry and over turfs on Columbia Drive. 